What's going on, everybody? <clears throat> Been a couple days since we made a video. Got some allergies going on, so you'll have to bear with me if I gotta clear my throat or whatnot. Beautiful, beautiful day up here in the North Woods. As you can tell, this is another vlog. The reason that we are making this video is, this is slightly a rant as well. Um, aside from how much I hate the word shout out, which you guys obviously already know, the other thing that, I mean, really, really gets on my nerves is when somebody asks for a shout out and then they say, just notice my finger was in the way, sorry about that. <laughs> When they say, I just started this account yesterday, I need more followers. And obviously I, I don't go out of my way to be mean to everybody, so I scream at the iPad real quick and then type out a reply. Just a good way, a good stress reliever. But the thing that people don't realize, A, people don't realize how powerful social media is. They think that they just need a bunch of followers and the whole world's gonna come to them. And yes, that is important in achieving whatever it is you want to achieve, but that is not the only thing. The biggest thing that people do not realize with social media, aside from how powerful it is, is the amount of time and consistent effort that it takes to, uh, to achieve whatever it is you want to achieve on social media, whether it be you want to get sponsorships, whether you own your own bass jig company, whether you want to be the expert on houses with red roofs. thing is it takes at least for us we've been trial and erroring I guess on social media for like 24 now probably four or five years and uh, mostly erroring because we figured out we figured out the way to get a ton of followers which is pretty simple I'm gonna give you guys my top secret information right here on how to get a bunch of followers and that is simply just follow a bunch of people but you don't want to be the account that has 10,000 followers and gets 10 likes on your pictures. So the biggest thing, which is with gaining a, or building a successful brand on social media, I guess, is actually achieving loyal followers, loyal supporters. And this is literally the same, the same way you would make friends if you're going to a new school or whatever. You know, you want a couple of friends, you talk to a couple of people, find out who has similar interests, bingo, bango, bongo, you got a couple of friends. So you go on to social media, you follow a bunch of people, you like a bunch of their pictures, you comment on a bunch of their pictures, you send them custom messages, you don't copy and paste four paragraphs and send that to them. Because we tried that, trust me, people try it with us and you can see right through it. And the craziest thing to me that, that <laughs> I wish I was in this position when I was younger is a lot of the people that follow us, we look at our analytics, we're like 13 to like 18 years old, and we didn't even start trying to figure this stuff out until I was like 20 and really probably didn't actually figure it out until like a year ago when I was like 23. So the thing is, if there's one 14 year old out there that's like, yeah, I'd like to be a professional walleye fisherman. I'd like to be a big time duck hunter, whatever you want to be. You got to think social media is going nowhere. Platforms may change, but the whole concept of social media is going nowhere. So in the long run, if you can put forth an hour, two hours, three hours, 10 minutes a day for the next 10 years of your life, you've got a good chance of literally achieving whatever it is you want to achieve. And if you don't know what you want to do with the rest of your life, if you haven't found your passion yet, it's all good. Be patient, be patient. I'm assuming that the majority of you are 20 years or younger watching this video. You got at least probably 50, 60 years left to figure out what you want to do. So don't be freaking out if you don't know exactly what you want to do. The biggest thing I can leave you with, follow more people, talk to more people, stop asking for shout outs. Nobody's gonna do it for you. You have to do it yourself. Find that passion, follow it, stay consistent in the long run. Regardless of how much time you can put in each day, 10 minutes, maybe, maybe 11 minutes, 11 minutes is one more minute than 10 minutes. Whatever you can put forth, whether you sit on the toilet for 20 minutes in the morning, that's 20 minutes could be working towards whatever it is you want in life that i don't that this rant hopefully will maybe even help just one person i'll be happy i don't know i kind of just turned on the camera and started talking for something in that you don't understand if you have a topic that you guys want us to go into more detail with i guess we, we do know a little bit about social media it's funny though every time we think we're figuring something out we, we found the hack or whatever we 
tweak it a little bit and it gets a little bit better. So it's always a learning process. But thank you guys for your support. Give us a thumbs up, thumbs down, whatever you're feeling. Appreciate you guys as always and happy adventure.